to look at two ways to use the classic editor. This is a free site, there's nothing extra, I haven't paid for anything on this. To access the original classic editor, you need to go in through WordPress admin. Go to post and then across to all posts. At the top here you've got add new, a little drop down and you can choose the classic editor which comes nicely across your screen and you can do everything you used to do before. If you're worried about using it in the Gutenberg editor it's not to worry because I think they're going to take this classic editor button away eventually. So add a new post in the block editor, add your title and then you're going to choose the classic editor block. <coughs> Excuse me. When the screen comes up, there's all these blocks which seems confusing. The ones that you use most often come up to the top. And I've been practicing with the classic one, so it's come up to the top. But you might not see it when it arrives on your screen, so you search for it here. It'll bring it up all by itself, and you just choose it. Think, oh that's no good, it's got no bits and pieces in it. Just click on it and everything appears. You can then start typing as you would normally. I'm just going to quickly make a paragraph to show you what happens. This is a bit annoying, ignore it. If you just want to work like you used to do in the classic editor, just pretend that isn't there. So say you want to make something bold, you would use that as you would before. You want to make another paragraph, hit return, keep typing, write your little bits and pieces, Oops. and then you want to add a link. So we'll put once upon a time, we'll go up to the link. You can type your link in from an outside source if you want. You can go to link options and link an old post if you like, as you would in the classic editor, because it's just the same. So we've done that. Let's make another another paragraph. And now we want to insert a picture. So hit return, go up to your add media button as you would. There's all your pictures in your media or upload a file if you've got a new one to upload as you always used to do. Choose your picture, insert into the post. Go down, you can write some more and you're still in the classic editor all the time. So you want to make quotations Link things to the left, insert a link. All good. That's all there is to it. Just keep using it from the top and you see that's disappeared. You say, oh, where's all my bits and pieces? Just click and it'll come back. Okay? Hope that helps. Oops.